All right, welcome to week number one in EDCI 6615 at CSUB. Our objectives this week are first to get to know each other, but getting to know each other a bit and above beyond the superficial getting to know each other, but more in the sense of understanding the community that we serve. So who exactly do you serve? Give us demographic information. Tell us about the position that you're in. Tell us about the students that you have either in your class or at your school. How many EL students do you have? How many students do you have with special need? Um, all the above. And this is important because it helps situate us in understanding who we are um, as educators and the experiences that we're bringing to the table. And then our second uh, objective is to understand our relationship to technology. So now the big picture, and this is a great quote that kind of situates us in the context of the learning. So for perhaps the first time in history, children genuinely have the knowledge of value in wider society, well beyond the small private sphere in which they are often sequestered. But it also had two adverse consequences. First, it has allowed policymakers to rhetorically celebrate children's digital expertise with the effect of undermining the case or perceived need for educational support or indeed even regulation of the digital realm. So to better understand what exactly it is that kids know and what exactly it is that they are doing, we're going to first understand what we know and what we're doing. So part of your assignment this week is to choose two out of the three articles from Jenkins. And these are really great because they give you a context or they give you an insight into what he was thinking at each point in time. So the first the first article in 2006 is very optimistic. 2014 gets tempered a little bit and then 2020 is during the pandemic and then it gets a little bit gloomy. You're also gonna start your online personal activity tracker and this is gonna require you to track two days and uh, it's gonna help you understand what exactly you are doing um, with technology. And this is gonna be important because it's going to then drive the next assignment where you're trying to understand what exactly students are doing in the technology. You're also gonna participate in two flip grids. The first one is gonna be where you're gonna introduce yourself, the one that I mentioned earlier. The second one is going to be driven by your online technology tracker. All the directions for submitting your work are going to be found on Canvas. Please reach out if you have any questions.